you be? I never recognized your face before, for a long time. I always look in those peoples, that I know who they are, and what they look like. When my show began, I could count the number of kids coming in the party. I wish that one child had survived, but I can't remember her. Why do you feel all alone? To dancing in the night sky All the joy will be bright To listen in sound my song Is someone here? I can hear someone walking in my room I may be blind, but I can listen. Perhaps not. <laughs> well, hello again! Hey, Bonbon! Bon, I think I saw a birthday boy over there! We should give him a surprise! Calm down, Phantom Freddy! I understand what you're feeling right now! Try and calm down a bit! You're scaring him! I know! Let's count to three! And surprise him! Ready? Okay! One, One two, two, three! Happy, Happy birthday! birthday! Hello, boys and girls! I hope you have a wonderful time in your life! The show time is almost up! Not a moment long until exact time starts! Don't forget, if you didn't make it to the show at the right time, you lose your opportunity to witness a huge event. And so, I take a bow to you. Hello in there. Is someone there? Maybe it's another person. Is it from here? Knock knock. Are you in here? Someone's watching us. We need to leave now. We will see you next time later. A one, a two, a one, two, three, four. And we dance all night. Because we, we are, are the beauty. Laura is elegant dancer, but we are the part of the small dancer. It's time for another dance lesson. Yay! Please let us out. We need you so we can get out. We want you to become a part with us. So please. You have to let us in! If we don't, we, we will never escape! FOREVER! Hello everybody, it's Steven. I really hope you'll like my... Another part of voice impression, I will say so myself. Well, the reason for that I'm making a voice impression for this... Because it's one of the special day, because it's only the third year anniversary of the system location... Which be coming around October 7th. And not only that, it will be my birthday as well. Yep, that's right. And the reason I want to make this as fast as possible, because I want to make sure if, I don't know, it might be interesting enough, like, I don't know what the plan is for anything what to do on my birthday or anything to do with like any sister location anniversary stuff or anything, but whatever. So here's a lot of thoughts and explain to you of how do they work exactly for this voice impression. So I really need to get this straight immediately as I could and, you know, like how it works exactly. So, here's the thing. I know for sure fact that only each character was just only a short amount of characters I have so far in a short amount of time for a second, I would say to myself. Because of, um, for once, I always do, like, write some script, dig into one of my head and something to do, like, what am I supposed to do exactly and how to 
characterize the 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 characters or like about their personality, how they work exactly. Even then, I'm not trying to be like intimidated to someone. Like I keep saying it over and over again, but I'm saying it just like almost feels like I make exactly the same character. But in the game assistant location, they do have some voice actors, except for one because of uh, Fanta and Foxy does have it in this location. But it didn't happen from the Ultimate Custom Knife. The Fanta and Foxy it can even confirm it's about the uh, a male who made the voice acting, but. I don't think it might be a fact about Fanta and Foxy because it still think it's whether a boy or a girl. But everyone keeps getting get in the comment section saying, um, Fanta and Foxy is a guy, not a girl. So what? I don't even care. Even then, we still been so confused and everything. Like, before the Ultimate Custom Night release, we are not sure who is, uh, what gender is Fanta and Foxy, whether it be a, a boy or a girl. Because it gave me confused and everything. And by the time I'm playing the, well, the full release of the, the, the Ultimate Custom Night, and everyone's also surprised now about uh, the voice acting, the who eh, one each characters have been voicing exactly. And then something tells me about Phantom Fox, they think it was a guy all along. But really, I don't think it might be impossible because of what would a guy have a, a nice nail polish and one eyelash and have some lip gloss? Will that be way really weird? Look like. Some kind of cross dressing, like a guy wearing a girl, girl's makeup and clothes and stuff. Um, I don't think that might be a problem or anything, but yeah, it's it's weird. So that's why I decided to put voice acting into a female because it, it was the way how appearance of the animatronics looks. It's actually a girl, so you don't have to judge me for that. You keep saying like, um, it's supposed to be a guy, but I'm not gonna change my voice. So anyway, but every each character's of uh, sister location all a girls. Except for one, it's Funtime Freddy, because he's only a one guy. So, <laughs> not a fair point is, exactly. So, yeah. But Funtime Freddy is only a male character in this location, and everybody else is all female. Except for Bon Bon, because I'm not sure. Because I, I listen to Bon Bon voice, because I'm not sure whether it's a boy or a girl. Just like the same thing from Funtime Foxy. So, I don't know. So, I decided to put Bon Bon's voice be a female, because of, um... The way the the voice acting for Bon Bon is kind of like low, and I think like a, a child, so I don't know. So I decided to pitch it down, I don't know, much as I would, because it went a fun time funny, was like, I don't know, being really good, of like, the one uh, who's a voice actor is Kingdom Golf. I was said, I love fun time Freddy's voice acting that much, it's really, <laughs> it really amazing enough. But everyone's always kidding, like, weird stuff's gonna happen, the conspiracy stuff, um, and mostly gonna make some kind of jokes for Funtime Freddy's. I'm not gonna tell you what it is, but say. So yeah, but the problem with that, um, I'm not really good touch ever doing Funtime Freddy's voice because they're trying to be in like a sound how Kane and Golf would. It's just being like, um, try sound crazy or just being like, um, how he did exactly. And I'm terrible at it because of, um, the way how I try to talk, it's not really that good exactly I can think of. And, it's so hard that I can't even do it exactly is to try and make it a laughing and then say something interact like how the one of those lines is says from the system location just saying and not only that about inner or anyone called it inner but it actually called it NR because inner is actually what said E on it because it's nerd is a N E R but I decided to call it NR because of everyone keeps saying it's inner so I decided to say it to NR be trying to spell it right but just saying but I'm, everyone keep judging me saying like it's entered no it's entered and everyone say no it's not it's entered so what I don't even care we just say whatever he wants to so if you want to like um burn into your memories always keep saying it all the time so like from now on it was always the rest of your life so yeah about entered um so <laughs> what do you think entered? about that characters it's really really hard for this because of um because in order it's really hard characters for a voice act because in order to tell us like a fusion endoskeleton is all combined together between Baby, Ballora, Phantom Foxy, and Phantom Freddy all together. So I decided to make it uh, a separate voice for each of them and then trying to combine them all together and trying to synchronize it as I get bigger but it's hard to tell like whether it'll be sync or not but I'm just saying it's the best as I could so far and 
it to top of all that, I might try to sound like a robotic noise as well. It's like how do robots talk exactly, even as a kind of, type of endoskeleton nonsense, but say, but yeah. In a closer, <laughs> um, the way I try to talk with, uh, try and be a little bit quieter for a second there, I'm trying to be how so quiet it is exactly how the one of those characters it is, like, uh, Baby or Beady Bab, I would say. Because Beady Bab is always sounds whispering, as what Baby is always means like, keep calm or something like that. So, yeah. Um, what else I can think of so far? Nothing changed for a bit, it's all exactly the same, except for the fact about I changed the pitch much, I was said, to make it like sound very girly, but I'm not really good with voicing those girls' characters exactly. I mean, it does sound like me, then I'm not good with doing the voice acting as a girl. <laughs> Would that be really weird? So, I don't know. But anyway, the reason I made the voice impression video for this one, because it's a very special day for me and the sister location for my birthday and his, their anniversary, I will say to myself, their anniversary, uh, we're going to have to celebrate, but there's still more to this, since it's going to be uploaded on somewhere on the, this uncertain day, because I'm not going to be here since I'm not have a problem with the, doing stuff in, in college, I still have no time, I'm not sure when will be time, but I'm going to tell you what it is, uh, what is going to work for the, the anniversary of sister location. So, I decided that I want to do that again like last year. Like I bring some friends with me, watch me play some game of system locations. And to top of that, it's gonna be um most people will always gonna keep talk a lot of some once because I always keep distracted myself. And mostly I've not been so focused. And not really easy enough to do um the game works exactly. It even involves doing the, if I use some Skype but it's so hard that I can't even do a sky because of like um, the audio noise, you won't be allowed to hear things. So it's gonna be hard and complicated. Even to show the share screen for them to see what they look like exactly when I'm playing. I'm just saying. But I'm gonna tell you what the when it's gonna be coming up for the the another sister location gameplays. I will do that on on October 8th because like I said, uh, I'm not gonna be uh, making on time because most of my friends is not gonna be here. But I decided to invite one person, it was none other than one of the YouTubers, and my friend of all is David Robinson. Yep, that's right. You might know him that much as you know any of them, as much as you would think of so far. But yeah, I decided to invite him so he can watch me play some sister locations. But I'm not gonna tell him what it is, but we have to wait for a bit when the time has come, exactly. So yeah. Since the, this voice depression video is going to be released on tomorrow, if it's you can see me for today. So that way, it's going to be for next one, it's going to be for another sister location gameplays as much. And hopefully enough, if he's available or not, so... Yeah, anyway, the, that is all we're going to talk about, and hopefully you will like my voice depression. If you don't like it, then, well, screw you, it's just... It's how it is, it's not like I'm being like, trying to same exact characters, from the original games and someone else's, so you can't judge anyone else's, so yeah. If you want to check out the whole uh, voice impression videos, uh, if you haven't checked out some of it, uh, I did so far, I'm gonna put the link in the description for the playlist so you can check out for yourself. So anyway, if you like this video, hit that like button too. Light them up! If you want to see my videos, so check out, you have to subscribe. Until then, I'll see you guys next time! Later!